Yeah, we're all, we're all feeling pretty good after the game. Um, it was obviously quite a physical game against the Bulls. Um, a lot of pretty sore bodies after it. Um, very, very physical and obviously, you know, we probably let ourselves too much to do in that second half um, after the first sort of 50 minutes. But um, yeah, we're obviously happy to you know come back into the game and put in at least the performance that gave us a shot to get some points in the end and you know potentially win it towards the end of the game. Big day of training ahead, did some training yesterday after the weekend, uh, come away with two points from the weekend which is uh, pretty positive. I think the boys are pretty happy with the second half, uh, got a bit of a comeback going and nearly won it in the end but yeah, we had a nice day on Sunday, played some golf and had a braai at um, in Stain City, celebrated a couple of the boys' birthdays uh, and yeah, just a full day of training today, get some gym, some units and then get into a full team session and uh, ready for the weekend. First time I'm actually 23 for Glasgow anyway. Um, it's been, I mean, we've played plenty of times together. Um, now nah, it's pretty cool. It is, it's, I don't know you say first time. I was chatted about it last week when we were re-signing about this is the one game we haven't played yet where me and Gus have uh, started, so that'll be pretty cool. Yeah, I, was like, I think every club that we've played for, we've played together and up until now, it's probably been the longest time that we haven't. So um, now nah, looking forward to it.
So yeah, we've, we've really enjoyed our time in South Africa so far. Obviously landed last Wednesday, um, we're greeted with some awesome weather, which is typical out here, so it's a nice change up from Scotland. Um, yeah, we basically got straight into it with training-wise, and, and then, yeah, just in terms of getting out and about, we get a little bit of downtime after training. Um, just, we're, we're so well looked after at St. Stethian's here where we're training, and Monte Cassino where we're, we're staying, so um, a few boys have um, indulged in steaks most nights, I think. Um, um, and just, yeah, spent a lot of time together as a group, which has been great. Well, basically I got up at uh, about 6 o'clock, maybe hit the gym first and then uh, we get down for breakfast and uh, we'll load the van straight after that to make sure everything's ready for a 9 o'clock departure so that means maybe going to the shops, pick up some water, food, fruit, anything we need just to get them through the day and uh, then make sure all the physio stuff is on, that's the last thing we'll probably go on because they're still getting strapped up before they hit the road. But uh, apart from that, everything is fairly similar to Scotland, except you're more mobile here, as opposed to being in one static unit. So everything is out of the base of the van here. This is basically Scotland in here. So we've just finished our, our double session today, um, reflecting back to the game on, on Saturday. A tough game, but it was it was a crucial two points in the end for us. Uh, Sunday was a down day for us, so um, me and George Horn was, was playing at Al, Al Kellogg and, and Stuart Lewis and the management team at the golf, and we managed to get the, the easy win over those two, so that was a, a huge bonus to, to come back from the, the lows of Saturday and, and coming away with a, a big win against those two because there was a, there was a lot of um, heated exchanges on the golf course. Yeah, no, just a massive shout out to all the, the messages and support we've been getting from back home. I know uh, it's a far distance to come out and travel and, uh, and watch the guys out here, but we definitely feel that energy and uh, definitely we can feel a feel you's riding on our backs at times as well so no thank you for the support and uh, yeah can't wait to see you back at Scotston soon. Yeah.